Welcome back to Cast Connection. Let's go see what they've got today. All right, it looks like they have some kind of square recycle bin. Or maybe these are planters. I'm not sure what these are, but what's the price point on these? These are 25 cents. We've got some of these utility carts. These are things where the whole panel rolls up. I think it's stocking for the hotels and things. Of course, our big heads are still here. Doesn't look like they have a lot of outdoor stuff, but these are actually cute. Like they make great art supply stores and stuff like that. And I think we got these for $10 one time. All right, let's go ahead inside and see what they have. Hi. Okay, guys, let's, um, all right. So, what do we have? Oh, well, look at these. Got a bunch of masks for $1. For 50 cents. And, oh, a steam boost for the Swiffer. These are like those wet pad things. For $1. Okay. And we've got some of these file cabinets. They're $10. There's a shorter one. This one is $10 as well. Here's some really short file cabinets. Looks like five dollars. More file cabinets. Look at this. This is kind of cool with this long, like buffet style thing. That's really amazing. Wow. That doesn't have a price on it. Somebody must have grabbed it already. Are these cowboy boots? Do we have cowboy boots here? Are you kidding me? Cowboy boots. Seventy-five dollars. These are brand new. Wow. What are these ones? $75, guys. Ladies cowboy boots, they're Justin style boots. I don't know much about cowboy boots. I don't wear them, but they look like they might be a pretty good brand. A stampede, that's a cool find. See, it's really cool, some of the really amazing, obscure, weird little things that you'll find here. So these must be all just like the auctions. They're auctioning this stuff off when you sign up and use that QR code, the employees can sign up and purchase some of this stuff, which is super cool. Props. Isn't that amazing? Okay. And let's go see what they have over here. Oh, it looks like we have got, oh, these are cute little votive jars. 50 cents. Here's some glasses. I actually like these glasses. They're a dollar. I might get a couple of these because these are you know, I like thinner glass glasses because it doesn't make your soda go flat as quick. And we've got some coffee cups. Just plain old white coffee cups. 50 cents. And what about this little tray for 50 cents? Like a little condiments tray. Guys, look at this drafting table. Isn't this amazing? That's what I'm saying. You find the weirdest stuff here. This one is $15. Wow. That's actually really cool. And we've got a desk. A great big desk. And here's some trays. What's the helmet from? We got a helmet. It's ten bucks. And what's this one? This. What are these? It feels like it might be wrist guards or something. Um, here's some sweatbands. It looks like. Got a bunch of monitors, some trays. What are these trays? Oh, these are nice, too, guys. These are glass. One dollar. Very nice. Very cool. I wonder where the helmets are from. That's really crazy. What are the helmets from? Ten dollars for the Garth helmet. I don't know much about it. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe it was from Tight Tails or something. This is headgear. Sports instructions headgear. One dollar. And then look at all the boxes you guys can get. These boxes are free. How amazing is that? I love that Disney does this. Recycle, reduce, reuse. So if you needed boxes, you could grab some free boxes. Got a bunch of monitors here. I think these are like $7. A bunch of monitors. Um, let's go see what over here. Oh, we got some shoes. These are colorful. Look at how colorful these are. These are amazing. $15? What kind are they? What does it say? 
Um, pink sneakers. I kind of like these for $15. Wow, I like that they have great tread on them. Huh, they must have been part of some cast member's costume. Let me see if it has a brand. It does not have a brand though. It just is probably some off kind of style something. All right, $15 on those. And let's see what these are. Oh, these are like little moccasins. Clark's, $15. We've got very limited sizes of these. I bet these are comfortable, but oh my gosh, these are so comfortable. They're so soft inside. Wow. Um, oh, we've got red ones too. Look at the red sneakers. If you don't like the pink ones, they have red ones. Wow. Oh, and it looks like they've got cream. They've got all different kinds of colors. Look at the cream. Oh my gosh, I might have to get these. Look at the green ones. These are adorable. I actually love those. I bet they're really comfortable too. They they feel comfortable. I might have to. So the green ones. And what size is it? A seven. This is, this is the size I need, guys. I think I might grab some of these. The green ones. What else do we have? Red. We have a green, green, red, um, pink, green, red, pink. Red and then these must be the Clarks. Oh no, they got some white tennis shoes. Look at these. Okay. So all these are probably part of a uniform or some some of it, a uniform or something or other. This is why they have them. And what else do we got? More white shoes. These are male sneakers. These are more pink ones. Wow. And they're very cushioned. I think that they would be very, very comfortable. They're very cushioned. I might have to get a pair of these green ones. Because these would be great for a Tinkerbell costume, wouldn't they? These would be great for a Tinkerbell costume. I bet they're super comfortable. I might have to get those. And let me see these. These are all smalls, so. though. Oh, guys, look at these little Easy Spirits. $15. Really cushioned in there. They're very nice. all small sizes though yeah we might have to pick up these green ones all right guys and we got a bunch of bubble wrap i'm going to grab some of this bubble wrap when we come out too because we definitely need some packing supplies this is always great stuff and again like i said i love that disney does this recycle reduce reuse i know there's a lot about you know disney adds to the whole like population to break down the climate stuff but they do a lot to recycle and reduce and reuse i mean can you imagine opening up billions of packages and saving all the bubble wrap and bagging it up and then offering it for free i mean that is such a such a great thing that they do for the planet we've also got some more chairs i don't know where these chairs came from and these ones look like they are twenty dollars each these are nice they almost look like they came from the poly don't they i'm not sure they almost do they look like they came from the poly and of course we showed you all of these statues and things last time and let me show you more garland guys more garland i mean how pretty and this one all has like hi ho and look at this 15 dollars. and guys this garland is huge like look at that that's one whole strand 15 dollars. and look at it, it's all decorated you've got all kinds of bulbs and beads on it Fifteen dollars. Beautiful. HDMI, I have the Roku, so, I could put that so I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Would you guys purchase this? Is there any that you like? It's amazing. Look at the big balls on there too. The big decorations, the ornaments. Those are cool. Ho ho. Fifteen dollars. Okay. What else do we have? Shower caps. Some shower caps. If you need a shower cap. All kinds of remote controls. Here's another wreath. Wow, this is a good one. We showed you guys wreaths last time. Isn't this beautiful? It's really big. It looks like it is $150. Or no, $50. Sorry, $50. And again, guys, this is why I said I love to come to Cast Connection because I'm all about the property control and the kind of weird, obscure things that you can find. Um, the merch, you know, it's usually the same merch that they have at the other, at the outlets. So um, it's nice that you can kind of, oh, and they have some wreaths. These are smaller wreaths. Look at the smaller wreaths. Those are cute. What are oh, or, or, no, are those garland? That is really cute, garland. Oh, so this is shorter garland because it's only $10. That one's all shorter garland. And look at this picture. It was probably in an office somewhere. And it is $50. How cool. 
cool. Okay, guys, I do think I'm gonna grab these sneakers because I think they would be really cute for a Tinkerbell outfit. Um, let's go check out over here what else they've got. Okay, so this is a bunch of the merch. And again, like I told you before in our previous videos, you can probably see, this will probably be the same kind of merch that you're gonna see at the outlets. Um, pretty much here too. Every once in a while you'll find something that, you know, wouldn't be at the outlets, but mainly what I look at in the merch area is pretty much like the pins, and sometimes the male shirts looking for Mr. Pintopia for a shirt. Um, and then I'll look at the food. I'm not a big merch girly, so this is kind of cute though. That's cute. But let's see what else we can find. Got some ears. These are some marathon ears. 2024. Super cute. And then we still have these. They've had these for a long time, guys. These Disney pins from Happy Week Halloween last year, 2023, with the Horn King. Okay. Oh, look at the pajamas. These are really nice, though. These are nice. And they are $28.99. They were $34.99. Got a bunch of coffee cups. If you're a coffee cup girly or person, got a bunch of those. Let me see what else we've got. This over here, guys, is Mickey's Treasures. It's only for the cast members. Guests can't go in there, but it's super cool. Don't get it on. Wait, 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 wait. Mickey Mouse 50th anniversary. It's $9.99. Let's see. Very cute, very cute. Boy, they are really down on their pin stock. So, I mean, still, the only pins that I'm still seeing are the Miraverse ones. We've covered these before. I mean, these are really cool. I don't know why they didn't really catch on. I mean, they're fun. This, is, of course, is Ariel. And then we've got the Mally one, which is really neat. We've got Buzz Lightyear here. That's a fun one. And we've got Minnie Mouse. Look at how cool she is. And then we've got Jack Skellington. I don't know why these didn't catch on. I don't know why more people didn't fall in love with them. Uh, I think this one is Ursula. Look how cool that is, Ursula. And down here, I think this is Monsters, Inc. I mean, what? These are so adorable. I don't know why people think. Um, of course, I don't know who this is. This is Belle, I believe. This is Belle, somebody told me. And Hercules. So if you guys know, I think Mirrorverse was like a video game that people were playing. Very cute, very cute. But it doesn't look like they have a whole lot of other pins around right now, which is unfortunate, because like I said, I come for the pins, the property control, and the food. Ah, look at this. This is crazy. Look at this. Is that Hocus Focus? What else? What else can we find? Yeah, I'm not seeing a lot of pins. That's crazy. I don't know, we got some phone cases. Um, some drink bottles. Yeah, the pins, the pin situation is dire. Look at how cute the sundress is though. It's a Lily Pulitzer. Isn't that cute? Lily Pulitzer um, was 198. They have it for 99.99. Cute. But yeah, I think the pin situation is pretty dire, guys. I'm not seeing anything new. Um, oh, these are cute. Paint your little frame of Mickey. $1.99. Is there a figment one? Do we have a figment one? Mini, mi they're all Mickey, it looks like. No figment. Because I'd straight up do a figment one. Let me see. Is that figment on this side? Or is this mini? Oh, this is mini. So we got mini. I guess we don't have a figment though. I'd love it if they had a figment. Would you guys do a figment? Would you do a Mickey, a Minnie, or a figment? I would straight up do a figment. But it's cute. So those are the ones that they have. Yeah, I don't see any figgy. No figgies. I'm sad. Okay. And we've got some of the 100 year new Mio's up there. Okay, it looks like we've moved the pins over here a little bit. So let's go check them out. 
Okay, so a bunch of the fig pins still. We looked at these last time, a bunch of fig pins. Super cool. And let's see if they have anything new that we haven't seen before. Mm, looks like everything we've seen. Star Wars ones. The Star Wars pin. I forgot what this character's name is. Is it Ash, Ash something? I forgot what her name is. Um, uh, look at this one. This is some of the Unlock the Evils keys. What else do we have here? Visions. Another Marvel. Um, a bunch of the Marvel Universe. Here's some Wakanda Forever. Really cool. And what else? What else are we seeing? Yeah, this is a good one. I think we'll get this one. Darth Sidious. Head over to the other side and see what else they have. So it looks like there's some more pins on this side. Oh, these are really neat. We've got Pluto, President's Day, and here's the mini one. And Mickey. These are fun. So look like they're all dressed up fancy, dress up day after day. And then also we have still have all the dancing character ones. This is Mickey the Great Little Taylor. Okay, I don't see anything we can't live without, but I do think I'm gonna grab a couple of these ones and grab the green shoes and let's go over here and check out the food, guys. So I think the last time we were here they told us that they weren't never they were not gonna get the cookies back, which was unfortunate. Um, because the box of cookies that they used to get was really, really cool. It was a great big box. It was about this big and it had like 50 or it was 60 frozen cookies in it and then when you baked them up the cookies turned out to be like this size they were massive so they were the great big ones that y'all get in the parks that are really really cool but in this section is all a bunch of fruit you know not too bad prices we have some red onions yams some limes some potatoes apples are really nice um i think they have oranges down there no those are onions more apples, pineapples, some grapefruit. And then of course, I think I showed you guys last time these ones, these are from the Galaxy's Edge, the cool kind of packaging that they have. They have these for $2 here. You do have to be careful though, because I think some of those, just check the expiration dates on them. Let me grab my stuff up here. Okay. And all kinds of the chicken tenders, chicken chunks. Chicken chunks are $9.25, guys. And don't forget, these are massive bags. These aren't little bags. And we've got chicken tenders. They're $11.99, massive bags. All of these are great big cans of beans, hash, marinara, black beans, all kinds of stuff that you can grab. And it looks like they're out of the hot dogs today, but they do have the meatballs. And like I told you guys, these meatballs in the air fryer are amazing. You put them in the air fryer, you crisp them up really good, and dip them in a little marinara sauce. Come on, they're really good. And these big old slabs of ribs. I didn't give you guys a close-up last time to see how big these are. But these are big, and it's $24.50. Big bag of onion rings, some veggie burgers up there. Of course, our Minute Maid, we talked about that the last time. It looks like they're low on stock. Got a couple peppers. Oh, we got ketchup back. There's peanut butter, olive oil, just a lot of fun different stuff. Um, some soup. So they do have the pork tenderloins this time. They were not here the last time. And this is a great price for the pork tenderloin, $3.49. Really, really nice cuts. Um, they do have some of the smoked ham. And if you guys have not seen these packages of ham, when I'm talking smoked ham, when I'm talking a big package for $8.99, I mean, look at how big this is. This is a great big package of smoked ham. Um, I like to get the turkey. They don't have the turkey though. Yeah, let's see what else we got. Um, then we got the big pork butt roast. I think we talked about those the last time. Um, butter, the Danimals, big bags of cheese, cheddar, and mozzarella. And then, of course, these were all the dried goods that we had, the noodles, the big peppers, peanut butter, jelly, olive oil, hot tarts, silk milk, look at the big, big, um, these things. Big tortillas, look at these massive things. They make it great for wraps. We've also got meal, mustard. Basically, we don't think about it. And 
going to show you guys the cheese. So we talked about the cheese last time, but I didn't show you how big these packages are. The Swiss cheese is eight dollars, Provolone is eight dollars, and the cheddar is six dollars. But when I showed this to you guys, I don't think I showed you how big these packages actually are. I mean, have a look. This is not a small package of cheese. There's got to be, I mean, this has got to be three pounds of cheese. So that's a great deal. It's a great deal. We've got the True Moo. Um, let's see what else we can find. I guess that's because the other one was here. We've got some drinks. Nothing special there. Pizzas. They have the pizzas. They also have, I think, are these the biscuits? I think these might be biscuits that they have here. Two stone pizzas. Again, I told you guys that I bought some of these single dough, these single serving ones, and they, they're just too thick for me for the crust. But, um, you know, it's still a great deal. You got the buttermilk biscuits. And the sweet potato fries. The crustables, there's hash browns. These sweet potato fries are stunning. It's so good. And then what do we got as far as the ice cream? Oh, we got some haagen -Dazs. So these are those ones that we told you from Pandora. That um, the juice pops, they're really, really good. Pandora juice ice cream bars. It's the middle one that's the best with the lime. And we got some strawberry haagen -Dazs. We got some butter pecan, chocolate, strawberry, vanilla. And it is $2.50. I don't buy ice cream, so I don't really know what the price, how that is, how that figures into the price points. But yeah, super cool. Okay. And again, guys, like I said, all this other stuff is probably in the um, outlets for sure. So if you're interested in any of the merch, you can certainly find it, I'm sure, in the outlets. Um, but let's go check out their pin board. Oh, they have the... Encanto lounge bars. Look at the castles, guys. Wow, these are pretty. They're super pretty. This one's like this. Look, oh, look at the little Tinkerbell up there. Can you guys see the little Tinkerbell? Look at the little Tinkerbell. She's really neat. Um, I didn't see any eggs. I need to go back and get my eggs. I didn't get any. Do they, do they have eggs? I didn't see eggs. I need to go back and get some eggs. Uh, got some cookie jars. Let's see what else we can find. And then we'll check out the pin board. We have never had any good luck finding pins here on this pin board, but you know, it's still always fun to have a look because you never know what you could come across. Um, this Munchlings bag is stinking adorable though. Isn't that cute? A little crossbody. A very cute, very cute. Look at the Lotso Bear. Did I show you guys this one last time? How cute is that? Oh, uh, the Princess Challenge. These are nice shirts, guys. These are really nice. $14.99 that dry fit material. Oh, the back of it's all. Okay, all right, let's go check out our pin board real quick. See anything that's good up here? This is a good one here, a little C3PO. That's a good one from the Gingerbread series. Oh yeah, I don't see anything else. Okay guys, so that's pretty much what we have at Cast Connection today. We'll be coming back, like I said, we're gonna try to come back once a week. I know we had a little bit of a break there for a while, but we like to come back once a week, mainly to check property control. And I'm gonna get these really great tennis shoes for $15. I mean, you can't beat that, right? Okay guys, we got our bubble wrap. We're gonna pack it in the car. Thank you so much for watching and check back for our next video.